This is a Fox News alert, a sentence of life without parole for Ariel Castro and an unbelievable display of resilience and hope in the face of evil. As we heard directly from one of the three women held captive for a decade by a sick and twisted man. Welcome to America Live. I'm Shannon Bream in today for Megan Kelly. Ariel Castro learning his fate today at a Cleveland courthouse after pleading guilty to kidnapping three Cleveland women, holding them hostage for years. The judge handing out that sentence after Castro wrapped up a bizarre and rambling statement claiming he's not a monster. Amanda Berry, Gina DeJesus, and Michelle Knight were just 16, 14, and 20 when they vanished. Early we, earlier, we heard from Amanda Berry's sister who begged people to respect her privacy so she can be the one to explain to her young daughter exactly who her father is. We also heard from Gina De, DeJesus' cousin who turned and faced Castro and said in Spanish, May God have mercy on your soul. And finally, we heard from Michelle Knight, the first woman he kidnapped. His crimes ripped her away from her own young child, but she vowed her long nightmare would not ruin her. Ariel Castro, I remember all the times that you came home talking about what everybody else did wrong and act like you wasn't doing the same thing. You said, at least I didn't kill you. For you took 11 years of my life away, and I have got it back. I spent 11 years in hell. Now your hell is just beginning. 